Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and happy Monday. So we are in front of CVS today. We are going to run in and grab a couple of deals. I might show you guys um, two of my cards that I'm working with. So we'll see what happens when we get in there. This is the normal CVS that I go to. So we'll see what's in stock, what's not in stock and kind of go from there. I know when I was in here a couple days ago, there definitely were a few empty shelves. So we will see what we're working in once we get in there. We'll run the numbers and then we will go over it over everything when we get home hopefully it does not rain on us because it looks like it's starting to get cloudy outside so fingers crossed it does not rain while we're sitting outside going over the receipt that would be great um and today i definitely want to encourage all of you to be proactive um, if there's something that you need to do, there's a, a list of things that you've been putting off and procrastinating and deciding not to do. Today is the day that we're all going to do it. We got up this morning. Um, we got up a lot earlier than we normally do. My mom and I went to the gym and then um, I dropped off my kids. We went to the gym and then I went to go donate a bunch of stuff, a bunch of like the extra couponing stuff that I have. And now I drove to CVS so that I can go ahead and do my couponing stuff. And then when I get back home, I need to eat something because I'm super hungry. And then um, my husband and I are gonna go to storage, get all the Christmas stuff, put away the Halloween stuff. So I'm definitely trying to get back into the groove of like being active and doing things more things during the day than what I normally do so I definitely encourage you guys today to take out some time to get done what you need to get done and don't keep waiting and say hey well I can do it tomorrow I can do it this weekend go ahead and take today to get active get out and do the things that you've been trying to do so let's go ahead and run inside Select Nivea, any Aquaphor, or use her own skincare is on a promotion. Spend 20 and get a $10 extra buck. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick up two of the daily hydration. Price at $10.79 in my store. That's going to total us $21.58. I'm going to use this 4 off of 20 lotion CRT. Then I'm going to use two of these 350 off one printable coupons and you can get this from the website. You can print a $3 printable coupon just for um, going to the website and signing up or you can share it with a friend. You can share their social media or email and then you'll be able to print out the $3.50 off. So I'm gonna use two of these. That's gonna leave me paying $10.58 getting back a $10 extra buck, making it just 58 cents for two, and this does track towards CVS Beauty. Maybelline is on a promotion, spend 15, get a $5 extra buck, and it is a limit of one, so I'm gonna pick up one of the Lash Sensational Mascaras, priced at $9.99 in my store. And then I'm going to come over here, and I'm gonna pick up one of the foundations, priced at $7.99. I'm going to use this $2 printable coupon from the Maybelline website when you sign up for their website. It takes you to a dashboard and the coupons you can print vary per account, but I was able to print out a $2 face coupon. And then I'm also going to use this $2 Maybelline mascara CRT that I just got this week. Then I'm also going to use a $4 instant coupon that we got last week that I did not use. I'm also going to use a $4 instant coupon that we got this week. And then I also have a $2 Maybelline Foundation CRT. After all of those come off, I'll be left to pay $3.98, getting back a $5 extra buck, making it free and a 102 moneymaker. And of course, this does track towards CVS Beauty. CoverGirl is buy any two, get a $6 extra buck, and it is a limit of one. So I'm gonna pick up one of the concealers, priced at $7.79, and I'm gonna use a $2 digital coupon for the face products for that. And then I'm gonna come over here, and I'm gonna pick up one of the mascaras, priced at $7.29, and there is a $2 eye digital that attaches to this. And then I'm going to use this 3 off of 15 CoverGirl Cosmetic CRT. I'm also going to use this $2 CoverGirl Cosmetic CRT that I just got today. 
also, after all coupons and CRTs, I'll be left to pay $6.08, get back a $6 extra buck, making it just $0.08 cents for both, and of course this does track towards CVS Beauty. Hallmark is back on promotion, buy three and get a $3 extra buck. So I'm gonna pick up the $2 cards because these do qualify. So I'm gonna go ahead and pick up three of these. That's gonna total me $6. I have this four off of two Hallmark CRT. That's gonna take me down to just paying $2, getting back a $3 extra buck, making all three cards free, any $1 money maker. So the bad bow toilet paper is buy one get one free again this week price at ten dollars 99 cents and when you buy two you get a three dollar extra buck now i've heard through the grapevines that when you pick up four you're getting back a six dollar extra buck so i'm going to test this out and see if it's actually giving back a six dollar extra buck i have enough extra bucks to kind of cover it so if it doesn't give it back then it's fine then we'll only get back a three dollar extra buck but i'm going to be picking up four of these I'm going to use this buy two and get one free coupon. So what this is going to do is, so it's buy one, get one free, buy one, get one free. So two of these are going to be free. So we're not paying for the bottom two. My coupon is buy two, get one free. So it's going to make another one of these free. So we'd be only be paying for the top one. That's going to be $10.99. Fingers crossed to get back a $6 extra, but that's going to make it $4.99 for all four. All right, guys, so this large one liter Crest Scope mouthwash is on sale this week, $4.79. My store just isn't tagged, but I took it to the coupon machine to scan it to see how much it was, and this is ringing up $4.79. So we have a $1 digital coupon, and when you buy one, you get a $3 extra buck. Now, I'm going to combine this with some toothpaste because I'm working with a four off of 14 Crest CRT. So let's go grab some toothpaste. So I had to definitely search for these because there are some that are not $3.99 and you can see that there's a bunch of gaps where they're tagged for $3.99 and I really didn't want to pick up the wrong one. So I scanned all three of these and all three of these are ringing up $3.99. The bottom two are the same, the top one is a little bit different. So I'm going to pick up these three. We have a five off of three a digital coupon. We also have a two dollar off one coupon, but I'm gonna be using the five off of three. So I'm gonna pair this in with the Scope mouthwash. So our total is gonna be $16.58. We're gonna use the four off of 14 CRT. We're gonna use a five off of three digital coupon. And then we're gonna use a $2 digital coupon for the toothpaste, because remember the five off of three digital, it includes the toothpaste and the mouthwash. So then we're going to be left to pay $5.58, getting back an $8 extra buck, making this free, and a $2.42 moneymaker. The last oral care deal that we're going to do today is going to be on some Colgate Total. So select Colgate toothpaste are on sale this week for $3.49, and when you buy two, you get a $4 extra buck, and it is a limit of two. So we're going to go ahead and pick up four of these. We just got a $1 digital coupon that we are going to be using. Then I'm going to be using a three off of 12 Colgate CRT. Last week, we also got this $2.99 off instant coupon that I will be using in this transaction. And then from the Colgate website, I was able to print out these 75 cent off one printable coupon. So I'm gonna be using three of these. We're picking up four. So we have the $1 digital for one, and then we're gonna use three of these. So we are gonna be left to pay $4.72, getting back an $8 extra buck, because remember the deal is buy two, get a four, and we're buying four. So we're gonna get an $8 extra buck, making it free in a 328 money maker. Alright guys, so we are back from CVS and this is everything that we picked up for our first haul. So everything turned out really great. I don't think that I had any issues and I did pick up a little gift for one of my kids. I'm going to pick up another one in a different transaction later on this week. But I thought it was super cute and I was able to incorporate it into one of my deals. So let's go over our receipt super, super quick because it is windy and it's starting to get dark. All right, you guys, so here are all of the items I picked up in the first transaction. So there's all of my Crest, there's all of my Colgate, there's the Babu toilet paper, there's the Hallmark, and then there is the Maybelline. 
So here are my 75 cent off printables for the Colgate. There is my $2 for the Maybelline, my digital for the Crest. There is the digital for the Colgate. Did another Crest come off? I'm so confused. 5 off at 3, $2 off 1. So there's another Crest that came off and I don't know what that is. So, because there's the, there's the 5 off of 3 and then there's the $2 off 1. This should be for the Crest toothpaste and then there's another $2 Crest that came off. I don't know what that is, you guys. But there's a dollar off with the Colgate. And then there is my buy, one, my buy two get one free for the toilet paper. There are all the rest of my CRTs. So I ended up using $23 in extra bucks. So I paid a subtotal of 45 cents. And I did get back, I can't show you guys the extra bucks because I already used them in the, um, the following transaction. But I did get back $6 in extra bucks for the Babu toilet paper. And I'll show you guys right here what it says at the bottom of the receipt, if it'll focus. Buy two get a $3 extra buck quantity toward this reward for quantity needed to earn two. So I don't think that it's a limit of one this week. Don't quote me, but I did get back a $6 extra buck. So yeah, I got back $6 for that. I got back $5 for the Crest. I got back $8 for the Colgate. I got back $3 for the Hallmark. I got back $5 for the Maybelline. And then I got back $3 for the Scope. So in total, I got back $30 in extra bucks for this transaction when I only used $23 in extra bucks. So the second transaction I did, I picked up the doll for my kids. So that was $4.99. Then I picked up the CoverGirl and then the user in this transaction. So there are my printable 350 off coupon for the lotion. There is my $2 CoverGirl. Ooh, one of my cover girls didn't come off. Yeah, one of my cover girls didn't come off, but that's okay. So there's my $2 cover girl CRT, my 3 off of 15, my 4 off of 20 uh, body lotion CRT. And I used $22.99 in extra bucks, so I paid a subtotal of $0.66. Cents, and I got back the $6 in extra bucks for the cover girl, and then I got back the $10 extra buck for the use room. And I also didn't realize, but this doll actually tracks for the spend 30, get a $10 extra buck because on the bottom of my receipt, it says that the, I have $4.99 tracking towards that deal. And I didn't know that because it wasn't tagged. I just picked it up for my kids. Um, so I thought that was a really cute purchase. So um, when everything is said and done, this turned out to be a really, really cheap haul considering my first transaction was a pretty big money maker for me. And I wanted to go ahead and use that money maker to pick up the doll for my kids. So when I do tomorrow's transaction, I will probably incorporate do picking up another doll for my other kid. Um, just something cheap here and there. I'm trying to pick up little things that I can incorporate with my other deals um, and use extra bucks to pay so I'm not paying a whole bunch out of pocket and still getting something really cute for my kids and my smallest is obsessed with tinkerbell and this is about as close to tinkerbell as she's gonna get from cvs so i think that she's really gonna like it so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and definitely check out your stores for the babo toilet paper if you guys have it i think i took the last ones that were there at my store so when i do my other transactions i'm gonna have to go to a different store and also pay attention to your store limits the the Walgreens around me have started limiting two paper products per person so you can get two toilet paper, two paper towel, and two boxes of tissue per person. My CVS has not done that yet so that's why I was able to pick up four. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys give it a big thumbs up and I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. Bye guys!